Since the release of ChatGPT in November, users have accessed the AI chatbot only through the OpenAI website. But on May 18th, the company debuted the official mobile app for ChatGPT. Now at launch, it's only available to iOS users in the United States, but the company says it'll be expanding to other countries over the next few weeks and an Android app is coming soon. As you'd expect from OpenAI, the app is pretty slick. It syncs all of your chats for your account so you can pick up where you left off on another device. And it also integrates OpenAI's Whisper technology, which is a speech recognition system. And that allows you to speak your prompts into your phone or iPad. And ChatGPT Plus subscribers can access the higher performing GPT-4 model but unfortunately, the app doesn't initially support web browsing or other plugins. I'll be eager to see that capability added soon. Install ChatGPT just like any other app. Go to the App Store, search ChatGPT, and you'll see the official app from OpenAI. When you open the app for the first time, you'll be prompted to sign in to your OpenAI account. If you don't have one yet, you can create one using an email address or an existing account with Google or Apple. After entering your credentials, you'll get the usual disclaimers, and then you'll be presented with the familiar ChatGPT interface where you can type your message or choose the speaking option at the right to enable that whisper feature. And then from the menu at the top right, you can rename or delete your chat. You can start a new chat. You can view your chat history, or you can go into your settings to manage your account and subscription. The haptic feedback option refers to the vibration of your device at various points in your interaction with ChatGPT. And within data controls, you can export your data or delete your OpenAI account. Be sure to subscribe at thestreamline.ai to keep up to speed with the evolution of ChatGPT and other exciting AI technologies.